Alright, hey guys, it's Rudis one back with another M2 Machines video. And in this one, I'm going to have a couple Hot Wheels in here. Just because what I got for Christmas, and this is all the stuff I got for Christmas. Alright, so first of all, is the uh, Carroll Shelby Tribute Car GT350R 1965. This is the blue one with right, white stripes two white stripes going down the middle all the way back starting on the grill too this is uh... release SB01 I don't know what that means but yeah alright next is also SB01 which is the other one same 65 GT350R tribute car Except this one is white with blue stripes down the middle, back and starting in the grill. There's a little tag there that says, I'm not sure if you can see that, but Carroll Hall Shelby, 1923 to 2012. It's on both of them. Alright, next is another release 7, because, um, er, wait. Yeah, there's the fact, the master cylinder, and there's what the master cylinder does. It's on all drivers, it's just different parts. But this is a release 7. It's 1974 Fairlane 500, yellow and white. I really like this one personally. Well, was, I'm not a big Ford guy, I'm a Chevy guy. But this one I think is very cool. I like the wheels on it, if you can see those. I like those wheels and the paint. Just, I love that paint. Alright. And this is release 8. This is what I already have. I have two other ones. Uh, 57 Chevy and Corvette in my other video. So 57 Chrysler 300C. White. Red interior. Detailed interior. It's nice white color too. This is the fact that's on like it's it's one fact per release, so it's, I think that's pretty cool. But yeah, there are the other ones in the release on the back. I have the top one, and uh, um, I have the first three. So yeah, or wait, I don't know what I'm talking about. I have the first one, the third one, and the second to last one. So, yeah. I'm planning to get the rest of those because they're always in the store. I just don't have any money right now because I just bought a big ticket item. I shouldn't say that, but a RC car. So, Alright, next is uh, Auto Hauler. This is the 50 years of ET mags. This is nice. This one, this is all they have in my local store. I got this one for Christmas though. This is all they have in my local store. Get a set and get going. This is a 58 Chevy Spartan and ET Mags trailer, obviously. It says ET Mags right on the door right there. If you, can, I don't think you can see. No, you can't see that. But yeah, ET Mags right there on the door. This one's nice. It's a release really 7. So, yep, that's that. Okay. Next. This is release 6. It's the OK Cars. It's the used cars and trucks for Chevy. I think they had that in the 50s. 60s, maybe, also. I'm not sure. Well, it's a car hauler with the again a 59. Oh, this is actually 59 Chevy Viking, so that's not the 58 Spartan. Still a nice truck. And in the trailer, you have a 57 Bel Air, all green with the white top. It's got green wheels too and white walls. It's a nice car in there. 
green interior also. It's a nice trailer. Sorry about that. Next is uh, release five. So I have five, six, and seven. This is a Shelby Cobra. Or no, it's a Cobra trailer. It says powered by Ford. 58 Ford C500 cab over engine, the Cobra trailer, nice truck. Shelby American Incorporated, nice truck. That says no riders Cobra. Okay, next, this is um, the Dodge, or Plymouth Cudas, the 71s, to finish my release 5 for the uh, Autolifts. I like the one on the bottom, that's nice, red, it really shines in the light, that nice red with the black. They both have the same spoiler. I like the wheels on the bottom too. Those are more uh, new style wheels. I think those that's close to what they had on the SRT10 truck, but I'm not sure the Ram. The hood's open on the bottom one too. I don't know if that one was open at top too, because I just found this one. I've had this for a while, but I just found it. But yeah. And the one on top silver with the orange hemi uh, stripe, I guess. But yeah, those are my uh, new M2 machines I got. They're those ones. I just showed five, six, and seven. And uh, again, this, the drivers and the two Shelby cars. Those are what I have right now for M2s and all my all the other ones in my other video. And now, I said in the beginning, I'm going to have some Hot Wheels in this one. So I guess i got to make you guys a promise. I have a lot of other Hot Wheels. These are just the ones I haven't opened yet. And I have a couple other ones, but... I got these for um, uh, Christmas. So this is a 70 Chevelle SS Wagon. Fire Chief. Man, it'd be awesome if they had Fire Chiefs that drove these back in the day. That'd be sweet. But yeah, I usually don't collect uh, Hot Wheels because I think the M2s are more detailed, but I think this is better um, value. It's good detail and it's cheaper too. But there's that one. This is a showroom. If you see me having any more Hot Wheels in my videos, they're probably going to be showrooms. Because I think these are the best. This is a Ford Thunderbolt. I don't know exactly what year this is. Maybe it'll say on the back. Yeah, I don't know what year this is. But I like that. That's a nice car. It looks like a drag car. You can barely see the front wheels. So... Bats in the back, it looks like. I think the bottoms are nice for these, for the price. The chassis. And next is the Dodge Challenger concept. Which obviously, I don't know why they called it a concept. Because this car is on the roads, you see them almost every day. But those are some nice wheels, I like those wheels in the... Green ghost flames with the green actual challenger. It's a nice car. But yeah, those are my Hot Wheels. So, like I said, if you if you're gonna see me collecting any other Hot Wheels, they're mostly gonna be showrooms. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy enjoyed my video. Please uh, comment, rate, and subscribe. Like always, down below. Now, so yeah, those are 
on my new pickup. So if you want more, like I said, subscribe. And please uh, like it if you liked it. And if you didn't like it, uh, hit thumbs down. Alright. Peace, guys.